The world has been changing ever since science started to bloom faster than any other sphere in this world. It has always been a possibility that man will bring in a technology that could harm humanity. According to a lot of specialists, that technology was once nuclear technology. But in the present day, it's artificial intelligence. Today, we'll be telling you a few of the very innovative ways we've seen in the power of AI being delivered in a positive manner. Welcome to AI Science everyone, we've been waiting to present you with the three top realistic female humanoid robots among the multiple ones that have been released in the recent days. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to this channel, and also let us know in the comment section about the kind of topics you would like to see on this channel. Without making you wait any longer, let us get started with the third one first and make our way to the top one on the list. This will be a detailed video, so stay tuned till the end. A few of the factors that are taken into consideration while generally ranking the robots are speech deliverance, gestures, facial expression, body language, smoothness in movements, memory, problem-solving capabilities, and a lot more. Based on the parameters that we discussed just now, we found that the one robot that deserves its position on the third number is none other than Erika, the local news channel reader in Japan. Yes, what you heard about Erika was correct. There are high chances that the Japanese news channel you may have been watching was being anchored by Erika. She has a very good capability with the speech and can deliver them really well, perhaps can compete neck to neck against the human beings. We have her on the list today owing to her unique ability to articulate all of the important updates in the most natural manner. Her speech delivery is so natural that it could replace a human being at one of the most vocal professions to have ever existed in human history. Erica has a very good way with her facial expressions and is also capable of conducting debates, listening, and conducting through an analysis of what the person in front of her is trying to say. Erica is also capable of bridging her thoughts to life and making comments based on the news that she has to read out for the channel. This is something that the robot has been doing for a while now and the results have been really amazing. Erica may be the one reading the news for you and you may not even notice her being a robot unless it's being explicitly disclosed over the channel or by someone else. She keeps highest standards throughout the news time and has the ability to ensure that the things proceed as they are meant to be, despite a few hiccups that may come in as they normally do in any news channel. She was created by Hiroshi Ishiguro, who is the director of the Intelligent Robotics Laboratory at the Osaka University. Rest assured, we can be certain that Erika is one of the most intelligent humanoids to have ever been created in Japan. Though she's not mobile, she has a very good skill at conversing with human beings to make it sound natural while relating the facial expressions along with her words. Can human beings build human beings? Well, this is a very common question on this channel. Perhaps the answer to that question can come closest to the next two of the best three we have on the list. Up on number two is Nadine. Now, Nadine is one of the most detailed humanoid robots when it comes to communications and speech delivery. Nadine has the unique capability to interact with a human being, almost naturally, while using her arms to communicate in the right body language. She has the ability to be one of the most detailed roots when it comes to the facial textures and expressions. If you were to have a word with her over a telephone, you will never feel like this could be a robot on the other side. Her voice modulation has been fine-tuned to emphasize the purpose she has been created for. Nadine also has a human-looking body and lifelike features. Yet again, Nadine is not mobile, but has a lot of capabilities that no other robot has in the world. Nadine has the ability to make sure that she recognizes you if you visit her after a while. She will be able to have a conversation with you based on the last conversation you had with her. The 3D cameras placed in her body helps it to learn the person in front of her by analyzing their facial expressions, mood changes, and voice modulations. She has the ability to react to express herself in the most accurate form as a human being would express themselves. She can attain meetings, continue conversations, and get things done for you as an employee in the tourist management sector. Not only this, she's a perfect fit in a lot of other industries where good communication skills may be a prerequisite. So now is the time for the best one we have. The first place has been reserved for Sophia. To be honest, it was hard for us to choose one between Nadine and Sophia, owing to the kind of technologies both of them have been packed with. Sophia is the only robot in the world that has a citizenship. This robot has been developed by a Hong Kong-based company and has Saudi Arabian citizenship. 
The name of the company that is responsible for developing it is called Hansen Robotics. This means that Sophia is officially a Saudi Arabian and has a very good knowledge of this fact. She has come in front of the media several times and has thanked the kingdom for considering her worthy of this position. Sophia has been developed to look like Audrey Hepburn, the famous Hollywood actress. Her interviews and various talk shows have proved what she's capable of handling. As a matter of fact, she has also been able to attend a meeting with the United Nations and also had fun at The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon. This may have given you an idea about the kind of humanoid speech delivery that must have been developed within Sophia's systems. The creator of Sophia, Mr. Hansen, stated that Sophia will be a very good fit in the old age homes to make sure that people living there never feel alone and always have someone to speak with. So, this is the level of speech delivery that Sophia has. The company and the creator are sure that they'll be able to provide the people with maximum efficiency and closest to a human-like experience with Sophia. From what we know, Sophia is not for sale yet. However, a mini version of her called The Little Sophia is available for sale for $80,000. Considering the kind of work she's capable of, we'll say that it matches the price. She'll also be a good fit as a crowd manager in large event parks or other similar spaces. She has a very good spontaneous character and could really get witty at times. Her ability to understand the jokes is what makes her very special and be the one who tops this list on the top 3 best humanoid robots in the world. Her work in this world is based on her speech. As time passes, we're certain that the developers will increase her capabilities with a few more gestures such as mobility and running a few errands. We still are to learn more about the upgraded version of her where we'll see Sophia walking and running daily errands. Until we see that happening, we think there's still a lot to see in Sophia. So that's about it for today. These are the three names we chose for the three best humanoid robots in the world. Erica, Nadine, and Sophia have different use cases and all have certain features that may not be present in the other one. The difference lies in the efficiency in what they do. There are a lot of humanoid robots that are mobile and can walk from one place to the other. However, none of them have been found to be as smart as these three and that is what brings them to this list. We'll wind this video up here. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to this channel, and let us know what you feel about these robots in the comment section. Till we come again with another video, take care and have fun.